5 Common Reasons Why Your Check Engine Light Is On It's one of every car owner's biggest nightmares, the check engine light has become illuminated in your dash. This is a sure sign of problems under the hood of your car, and it's hard to know exactly how serious those problems are, it could be a quick fix, or it could be a problem that leaves you stranded and costs you thousands of dollars unless it's addressed quickly. Either way, it's important to get to the bottom of the issue as soon as possible. Here are five of the most common reasons your check engine light might be on. 1. Loose or damaged gas cap. The gas cap on a car is designed to create a seal that prevents fuel vapor from escaping into the atmosphere. If the gas cap is loose or damaged, this seal is broken and fuel vapor can escape. This can also cause the check engine light to come on in some cases. While a check engine light can indicate a variety of different problems, a loose or damaged gas cap is one possible cause. As a result, it's important to check the gas cap regularly and tighten or replace it if necessary. By keeping the gas cap in good condition, you can help prevent fuel vapor from escaping and keep your car running smoothly. 2. Faulty Oxygen Sensor your car's oxygen sensor is one of the most important components of the emission control system. The oxygen sensor is used to monitor the amount of oxygen in the exhaust gas. It is located in the exhaust pipe, before the catalytic converter. If the oxygen sensor is not working properly, it can cause the engine to run too lean or too rich, which can lead to problems such as misfires, decreased fuel economy, and increased emissions. In some cases, a faulty oxygen sensor can also cause the check engine light to come on. While there are a number of reasons why an oxygen sensor can fail, some of the most common include physical damage, deposits on the sensor, and electrical issues. 3. Your catalytic converter may need to be replaced. A catalytic converter is an emissions control system that reduces pollutants from a vehicle's exhaust. CarMD says that a catalytic converter usually won't fail unless a related root cause, such as a faulty spark plug is ignored for too long. But eventually, the catalytic converter will give way with age, as 2006 model year vehicles were the most likely to need a new one. Symptoms of a faulty catalytic converter are sluggish acceleration, dark exhaust smoke and diminished fuel economy. Unfortunately, Global prices for the precious metals used in the converters have soared in 2021, and replacement catalytic converters can be quite expensive. 4. The mass airflow sensor may need to be replaced. The mass airflow sensor measures the amount of air coming into the engine and determines how much fuel is needed to inject into the combustion chamber. Symptoms of a bad mass airflow sensor are jerky acceleration, engine stalling and reduced fuel economy. Last year, this repair was most common on 2012 model year vehicles. 5. Check your ignition coil and spark plugs. The ignition coil in an engine transforms the battery's 12-volt charge into thousands of volts, which are needed to create an electric spark to ignite the fuel. Meanwhile, spark plugs provide the spark needed to ignite the air and fuel mixture. Spark plugs will wear out over time roughly between 60,000 and 100,000 miles depending on the vehicle. Worn spark plugs can cause engine misfires, reduced fuel economy, and difficulty starting the engine. If you have a bad spark plug and ignore it long enough, it will exacerbate the wear and tear on the ignition coil, and eventually they will need to be replaced in tandem. What happens if I ignore the check engine light? First, determine if your check engine light is just illuminated or if it is flashing. A flashing check engine light indicates a major internal failure and requires immediate attention. Regardless, do not ignore the check engine light. Continuing to drive with a non-flashing but illuminated check engine light can result in lower fuel economy and eventually lead to more significant and costly repairs. Many of the systems work together. So a failure with one system can cause a chain reaction in performance with the others. If you were to take in your vehicle for state inspection while your check engine light is on, you will fail the emissions test, the check engine light should always be checked as soon as possible to ensure the integrity of your vehicle. If you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel and the click on the bell icon to get new video updates.